Hello and welcome to a new video about measurement. We still want to measure level. Today we are talking about the hydrostatic pressure method. As we know, a certain height of, of uh, liquid eh, will cause an hydrostatic pressure. So actually what we could do is here we make a pressure measurement. So here we're measuring the pressure, yeah? and here is output I. Yeah? So it's a pressure transducer simply. Yeah? And this I is then reflecting the level. Yeah? Then we measure actually the weight of this head. We measure the weight of this head. Uh, well, since there is not only this head, yeah, but there could also be here a pressure, a air pressure or whatever gas is up, up there. Yeah. So in pressure tanks, we need to make some differential pressure measurement. Yeah. So we did, we need to, to measure this pressure and this pressure and only the difference between those two pressures would then display the height here, the head. Yeah? Therefore, sometimes you can even use this. Yeah? So make it there, then here, is one pressure. Yeah? Here is one pressure measurement, and then here the output is differential pressure. We could also measure here a second time and make the differential pressure, uh, so that there are several possibilities, several possibilities to do this. Yeah, so this is how this is how this is working. Yeah, so just measure the pressure, and because of the density, the weight of this, we know the hydrostatic pressure which should in be in there, and then we can calculate the level. Yeah. Then we can calculate the level. So actually, the, the, the plus side, huh? easy build, easy to build in, yeah? and, and adjust. It's easy to build in and adjust, yeah? and uh, it's accurate. It depends also on the density of the things and so on, yeah, okay. This is the downside. Huh? Depending on the intensity. And differential. Differential pressure is relative expensive. It's clear because I did two pressure measurements, yeah? so I need two measurements actually, and yeah, double as double as expensive. Yeah? Hydrostatic level. Hydrostatic pressure level measurement. This would be correct. Huh? Next time we are also talking about something which is very close related to there. Yeah? So we also measure the pressure, the hydrostatic pressure of this stuff. However, with a different approach. Huh? What this approach is, I will explain in next video.
for this time. Thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.